we can shorten the length of the actuator wire and maybe a little longer than that, maybe right about there. And then we will separate the twisted pair of wires using an X-Acto tip, just kind of working it until they separate. If you look carefully, you'll see that we can separate it into two distinct wires. Both ends of are leading or to that coil. And we get a hot ball of solder and touch it to the tips of the wire, which simultaneously removes the insulation from the wire and tins the, the wire leads. This is pretty fine wire. It's about uh, 44 uh, gauge, 0 0.07 millimeters, I think. This is a demonstration video uh, showing the technique. You can see the insulation kind of, that black stuff kind of rolls up like socks on a leg, or it's rolling down in this case. Now you can see how the wire looks silvery because it's tinned. So we take our uh, small actuator wires and we're going to solder them onto these two points. Uh, it helps to have magnification here. Like we normally would use a uh, binocular microscope with 10 to 20 times magnification. It can be a little bit fiddly. Um, takes a little bit of practice. The next wire down there is the antenna, by the way. It says ANT and the arrow pointing to 